Time and later for people who know what the hell they're doing. Is that a baby? This is my journey to alpinism. One of the crucial steps to becoming an alpinist, learn by doing. Matt and I have this great idea. Drive eight hours through the night, get to a park, and climb the next day. We're three miles from the gate at two in the morning, and the clutch blows. One of the hoses that supply fluid to the clutch blew up. At this point, we know there's no way we're climbing tomorrow. Thanks to some brave search and rescue guys, they got us turned around and I, I shifted that fucker 25 miles back to camp. Next morning, we got up, called every garage in town, got the clutch fixed, 60 bucks, no problem. Alright, so we're back on the road again. Um, we're gonna try and uh, figure out if we're able to climb tomorrow. We drive back into town. We drive down to the park gate and ask the question Is there any campsites available tonight? Negative. There's nothing at Warren's Road, Avon, Warren's Cubs Street, uh, 10 to 6 to Kirkman is available at the There's also a four person cabin there. So we camp out in this huge basin in Baxter State Park, ready to climb the next morning. Talk to the rangers and head out for their alpine climb. Matt and I are heading on our first day of alpine climbing. We're climbing up into those clouds up there, and then we're going to descend down, down here. I feel excited. Oh, I know we're good today. Yeah, you're going to get a, a first-hand view of this, uh, this whole adventure. Here we go. Oh shit, here we go. <laughs> Back tomorrow, back today. This is it here. I am. I was rolling over the top of the mountain. That's where we're climbing tomorrow. So, what do you think about climbing? It's cool. <laughs> is almost down. We gotta run this shit out. Let's go. Alright, you got me on belay? Here we go. Finish this route out. It ended up taking us about 12 hours to climb this route that we thought would take us nine which put us well into when the sun was going down. Here we are, we did it. We made it to the summit. Uh, the rack goes in the bottom, yep. Yeah. Uh, the sun is pretty well down. Uh, that was pretty close. And now we're gonna descend the trail behind me. But, uh, wow, what a day. What a day. Bam, 4,900 feet. There's Baxter Peak behind me. Yeah, I mean, it's an awesome day. We uh, ran into pretty serious storm clouds, got off route a number of times, uh, we lost a bit of gear, we had some rock fall. It was one of those days that you're never going to forget. If you like this video or you like what we're doing, please subscribe or visit our website at journeytoalpinism.com.